Hi, I'm Margaret. I've got a good old-fashioned British pudding for you today. I wonder if you remember it from your school days like I do. It's real easy to make and right tasty. So come on, let's give it a go. Now the thing about rice pudding is, it's thickened by the starch in the rice. So you have to have the short grain rice for this one. It's no good using the long grain rice, it just won't work. You'll need a large oven proof bowl for this one. This glass Pyrex one is a two litre bowl. And all you have to do is pop all the ingredients into the bowl and give it a really good stir. Next, we pop it into the oven for an hour. After it's been in for that time, we need to take it out and give it a stir. This helps the rice to move about a bit and not all clog together in the bottom of the bowl. So a good stir to separate the rice. Then we need to flavour it and help that lovely skin to form on the top which is absolutely delicious and we used to all fight over at home. Grated nutmeg is perfect for this. Oops, didn't mean to do that. Don't need quite that much nutmeg. Do give it a really good coating though. This really adds to a beautiful flavour. Then we need to make those beautiful golden puddles. So we use butter and little dollops all around the pudding. This will also help it to taste really nice. I believe butter always makes things taste better. Then pop it back into the oven and forget it for another hour and a half. Now that brings back a few memories. Can't wait to dive in. A generous spoon of strawberry jam and you have in my opinion the best end to a Sunday dinner you can get. Thanks for watching, have a great week and I'll catch you again soon.